Miss Penna, did you hear me? I did. Do you understand what I've told you? Yes, I understand. Cancer? Is there anything that can be done? Unfortunately, it was discovered too late. It is well into stage four, and it is too widespread for surgery. Also, due to its abundance, treatment will prove completely ineffective. Your only option is to wait it out, unfortunately. I see. How long do I have to wait until it, you know... It's hard to say at this point, but I would say you have maybe a maximum of two weeks. Thank you, Dr. Anderson. I appreciate the call. You've heard of the saying, distance makes the heart grow fonder, right? Of course. I love you and all, but we spend every day together. I don't think we've been apart for more than a day at a time. I love you too. What's bringing this up? Is everything all right? Yeah, everything's fine. I was just thinking. Would you be up for a little challenge? You name it. Anything for you, my dear. Would we be able to go one week without any communication with each other? No texting, no calling, no visiting each other. A complete blackout, so to speak, for one week. I'm not a fan of the idea, but I think we could pull it off. Would you be willing to try? For me? If it's for you, then of course. Honey, I did it. It's been a whole week. I almost didn't make it, but I did it, sweetheart. Tobin. Mrs. Penna. Sorry, I didn't know it was you. Is Valerie there? Tobin. I'm so sorry. Congratulations, my love. You made it a whole week. I'm so sorry I couldn't tell you. I just couldn't bear just to couldn't see bear you to see, see me literally falling apart. I hope you can forgive me. I love you so much. As the saying goes, distance makes the heart grow fonder. And that's true. My love for you is greater than can be measured. I know it's hard, but you made it a week. Can you do it every day?